What's going on? What's going on? Cam with Bitcoin Crazy, Bitcoin Crazy channel. On YouTube, yes, you can find us in all our videos at um, Bitcoin Crazy Channel by searching Bitcoin Crazy Channel in YouTube, and you'll find all of our videos, past and present, going on right there. But hey, guys, um, the only way you're going to be able to do it is hit the subscribe button. The subscribe button's right there in the right-hand corner. Um, it's a little green button. That's how you're going to get all your updates, everything Bitcoin, uh, free coins, faucets, um, you name it, anything we're talking about today, you will find past histories in my videos on that. But today we're going to talk about Ripple. Um, without mentioning what's going on with Bitcoin, it would be a shame. But so I will say um, Bitcoin is hovering around 14.4 right now, guys. From what I'm reading and everything that I'm seeing and, and talking to people, I think 14.2 is its new bottom. Um, can it go down lower? Sure, of course. But I think it's making a foundation right around this mark. Um, so I'm suspecting, and from what I'm listening to on the street, is that 20,000 is the next one. As soon as we break that 20,000, it's going to make it to um, 30,000, no problem. But we have to hit and break that next ceiling, which is the 20,000, which is having a horrible time breaking. So I think it's gearing up to get there. When I, you know, Will we see it this month? No, I doubt it. Will we see it in January? All signs predict, yeah, we probably will break that 20,000 ceiling here pretty soon. So on with Ripple price, guys. Ripple surges 38% to unseat Ethereum as second largest cryptocurrency. Holy mackerel. I'll tell you what, when we go to sleep and um, the Asian markets jump, they love to buy, guys. Asian markets love to buy. Europe, they love to sell. Uh, but Asia markets love to buy, and we're pretty much in the love of the buying as well. Um, as I look right now, um, Ripple is sitting at a dollar sixty-five. As I look at my other monitor, a dollar sixty-five. It jumped to one seventy-four, one seventy-six last night. Um, I woke up nicely this morning and saw my um, my, my portfolio up over forty percent. So that was huge. Um, so let's talk about what's going on. So as you know, since it, it's been a, just over a week, I believe, since the price was at 25 cents. It was 25 cents. So it's jumped 80% in the last week, guys. 80% in the last week. As you can see on this candlestick chart, you can see that it's just been moving up in this, all this accumulation right here. Um, the M MACD is right in here, and you'll see that it's just rolling up and down um, on the moving so you use that and you use the RSI and you should be okay with figuring out and seeing what's happening. As right now, when we look between Bitrix and if we look between HIP BTC in the charts, we're, see, we're seeing a head and shoulders right now. Um, and I think we just saw the flop on the head and shoulders to the plus side on HIP BTC. But now it's shaping up again to happen on Bitrix. Um, because they're not at the same price. Bitrix is showing it at $1.64 or $11.330. Um, Hit BTC is showing it at $11.607. So um, that is a difference between um, Ripple showing it as at $1.674 on Hit BTC, and we're showing it at $1.64 on Bitrix. Um, so there's different in prices and what's going on on those, but the head and shoulders should be taking place over on uh, Bitrix. So we should see an increase in price. Probably it's going to take off somewhere up to the dollar sixty-seven, dollar seventy something again today, from what I'm seeing. Um, but one of the reasons that it's up and it's climbing is because South Korea. South Korea is loving Ripple, and the actual value of Ripple out there is hovering around two ten. Um, so its volume out there is ahead of us. As you can see down into these, these are different exchanges, guys. You can see the volumes of the exchanges right here. This big thumb, um, I believe this out on Korea, it's showing as 210. Binance is showing it at $1.70. Bitfinex is $1.62. Coin1, 208. Bitrix and Coin1 and, and uh, Bitthumb are both Korean markets, I believe. Um, so you can see the 28210. Um, Bitrix is $1.67. Poloniex, that's here again, $1.63. And this one's in Korea again, guys. The Corbett is sitting at 208. So you can see 
what we're looking at and where we're going to be going. So, guys, if that's any speculation, um, expect Ripple to be over two dollars by tomorrow. <laughs> I, I'm I'm betting on it, um, but we'll see how long it takes us to get there. Ripple's global average now is a dollar eighty-seven, which represents twenty-nine thousand percent increase from January first, when it was valued less than one cent. One cent last year, or this last year, um, January first. Um, so the volume earlier today was seventy-two million for Ripple, seventy-one million for Ethereum. That's how we changed. Now it has flip-flopped a little bit, but they're bouncing back and forth. Um, as you can see, we just talked about this ripple price surge fueled by South Korea. I think we're just going to follow in South Korea's footsteps. Um, you know, so that, that seeks to be what is going on. So guys, um, once again, I'm hot for ripple. Ripple is one of those things you can jump in. A lot of us want to know, Hey, what's going to be the next coin that we can jump in and get a lot of volume on. Hey guys, one of the ones that I wanted to talk about, which I've talked about before and previous is stellar. It used to be Lumen, Stellar, Lumen, whatever you want to call it. It trades under XLM, XLM. Um, so take a look at that. It's sitting at 20-something cents. Um, I'm going to pop back over there, and I'll tell you where exactly it is. Um, but it's sitting somewhere around um, – let me take a peek right now. Lumen's sitting right now at 27 cents. So it's been moving this morning, um, which is which all intents is, is, is stellar. XLM, stellar. So that one's going to defy Bitcoin. So as Bitcoin sits, that one's going to move. So I'm predicting, and I'm putting my money on it, I'm predicting stellar as well, which some of you might know it as Lumen, trading under the symbol XLM will be the next dollar coin. Um, and that will happen this year. I'm predicting that will happen this year. So if you want to make some money, XLM, as well as Ripple. Don't forget our boy Ripple. All right, guys. Bitcoin crazy. Bitcoin crazy. Have a great day.